Hey everyone, welcome back. Today I'm going to be showing you how to get the new Artix game launcher. So first you want to go to your internet browser and go to artix.com. I'll leave the link in the description and you want to scroll down till you see game launcher slash alpha test. So you want to click on that and then you want to scroll down until you see Artix game launcher alpha for PC. If you do have a Mac, they haven't released one for that yet. So you'll have to wait and come back to this page until you can actually click on the link there. So you click on this link. And I've already downloaded it. It's a really simple setup. You just open it and run through the setup. It's so easy to just run through the setup. And then, yeah, you'll have the launcher. So if I type it in, Artix Games Launcher, I'll just show you that it opens and what it looks like. And, yeah, so you can launch uh, these games here. Now, the games that are grayed out, as you can see, I can go over Epic Duel and then my cursor disappears. And then when I get back to Oversoul, it comes back. So Dragon Fable, Mech Quest, and Adventure Quest will not work yet on this launcher. Adventure Quest Worlds will work, but the older Adventure Quest will not work. So yeah, now you can click on play and it will launch the game and you can sign in. It'll open a separate window with Adventure Quest. The game is still running on Flash, unfortunately, so it's not gonna be like uh, less laggy than the browser, but it is nicer to have than the browser because uh, you can play any other game if you wish to change afterwards over here. So yeah. Uh, if you click on Hero Mart, it will automatically lead you to the website. But yeah, thank you guys for watching. If this helped you out, please leave a like. I'll leave all the links in the description, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye.